go look by the rock wall and see how shallow it is there. Last morning at Cabrillo Harbor, Little Gibraltar. Um, about to go over and have breakfast with John and Alana and say goodbye. They're gonna head to Avalon today for the night and then they head back to um, Ventura. We are heading to the Isthmus to pick up Kristen and Dyer of the Black Lotus. They've never been to Catalina. They're taking the express over. We're gonna hang out in the village a little bit at Two Harbors and um, do a little bit of snorkeling maybe, and uh, then they're gonna sail with us, us back to LA. So that should be nice. They'll see what the passage is all about before they do it on their boat, and uh, see, see how everything works over at the island. So it's gonna be a nice day. It's beautiful out right now. The water is crazy clear, and um, the roll has slightly settled down. It's been a fantastic trip. Great to see you guys. Have fun in Avalon. That's right. Have a nice day. So nice to meet y'all. Thank you. I know that anchor's got very mellow once <laughs> once we hauled up. Right when we woke up, it was like glass. Yeah. I'm glad I hopped in this morning just to say hi. To yeah, place. I look forward to getting in the water at the isthmus. Me too. It's hot. It's the SV Rona. <laughs> 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 MV Rona. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it blows off. I don't think so. So we're 
we're getting closer to happiness. We kind of want to go look by the rock wall and see how shallow it is there. We're just doing a drive by right now, anyway. I'm going to come back around, Camille, and check right there. Now that the depth sounder is kind of found the bottom, you kind of got to let it like hang for a while, and it'll catch up to its like reality. over here compared to shows you how protected this area is. Camille, can you see down? What's the vis? Oh, you don't see any weed? This is plenty for a lunch trip. So we picked up Diane Kristen of the Black Lotus at the fuel dock, Two Harbors, and uh, came around the corner. It's blowing like 10 to 12 out, but it's very calm here. We're right by the quarry, so the quarry is right there. Um, I don't know the name of this little spot, but we just dropped like a lunch hook, so we dropped like like t t two or three scopes. Like dive boats everywhere. There's tons of like kelp and stuff, so. They're all gonna go snorkel. I'm gonna hang out the boat for a little bit and make sure she's on the hook happy. And uh, we're just gonna do a little bit of swimming and then have a legit sail home with all this wind. There's scuba divers right here. Whoa, is that a rock fall? <laughs> Rocks are falling. Watch the whole cliffside go. Steady, I'm gonna jump in, okay? Are you going to be okay? He'll be fine. It's nice how buoyant wetsuits are though, because you don't have to do anything, but just sit there. <laughs> There's a big ass calico basket here. Really? I mean, you guys are in like 60 feet of water right now. Give it to me and I'll, oh yeah.
Water's nice now, right? Beautiful. <laughs> it was so warm this trip. There's a weird, I don't know if it's a thermal here, but uh, the, um, there's a warm water vent right here that I'm sitting in. That's what happened to us when we were diving. We hit a zone that was 10 degrees warmer. I mean, because, but then closer to shore, it's cold, and you'd think the shallow would be. Yeah, it doesn't make sense because, like, I just swim over there. It's very cold right here. It's Yeah, it's funny. That's what happened to us on the backside, too. On the hook. Uh, I don't know where this is actually. I'll put the name of it below on the screen right now. But we love it. It's amazing. It looks like the most epic dive site we've ever seen. Like rivals the dive park at Avalon. I freaked out. I it's was like, so we gotta cool. Get out here right now, yeah, put it on. but we gotta head home and it's blowing like crazy out there. So we're gonna tie a reef in the mainsail um, and then get out to the wind line and see what it's all about and should have a fast sail home today. And hopefully not hear the motor. That'd be the that's the dream. So we're going to finish lunch and head out. Yeah. This motor is real slow. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please give us a like, subscribe, and leave us a comment. It helps us a lot. Thanks again to all of our patrons. Your contributions help us get the boat ready for big things. Until next time. Checking the sand for hell, but... <laughs> <clears throat> hmm? He's fine. Do you want me to sit in the boat so you can go for a swim? No, I'm chill. I'll probably dive in when everybody's on board and then climb out. <laughs>